Keeping medieval reenactment gear organized in a domestic setting can be problematic at best at times, especially for parents. Young kids get curious, it's just what they do. So I thought today I was going to make a um, just a means of organizing my armor and heavier kit that is my most commonly used arms armor, that kind of gear. Let's take a look. the armor stand is going to be the base. I'm cutting two widths of this and I'm cutting them 60 centimeters long. That's roughly speaking 24 inches. PPE on first. Alright, so I'm just going to use a very simple white glue for the base of the armor stand. Uh, I use a glue called Sigaflex. It's just a brand really, but it's quite weather resistant. So for when I do go on education tours out to schools and stuff, then this is going to resist some of that extra moisture you get in the air. Queensland where I live is a very humid place anyway, so it's the right glue to use. Very simple and common mistake a lot of people make is over clamping. What I mean by that is applying too much pressure. This can buckle the wood or weaken the joint. You don't want any of that. All you want is a very simple uh, joint which is going to last. Uh, it's not load bearing as such, it's simply creating stability. Rightio, we've got the um, everything glued in and assembled now. All looks pretty schmick. I'm just going to let that dry for a little bit and then I'm going to apply a, um, a stain and varnish. This is not historically accurate. I don't believe there's any evidence of anything quite like this as such. However, um, I needed something like this partly to tidy up my gear at home and also partly to display so as I say uh, this works for me um, and it's not super historically accurate or anything but that's fine um, it just simply works for, for what I need it to work for
Right guys, all finished, all done. Really happy with this. This has come out really well. It's really nice. It's got my gear off the floor. I'm very happy with it. There we go. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe and share. I'll catch you in my next video.